Hello, guys. Hi, Dr. Pradeep Kumar Shivastha. Welcoming to all of you in my Water Resources Engineering class. Today's topic is the infiltration and run of water. Dear boys, this is the two topics. Infiltration and run out. In the hydrology, infiltration means encroachment of water in your land force. Encroachment of water forcefully. Okay, and runoff means how much water you have kept balance in the rainfall season. So, in this fourth topic, we will discuss. So, let us start. First, we are starting infiltration. Infiltration is the process by which water on the ground surface enters the soil. It is the commonly used in the both hydrology and the soil science. The infiltration capacity is defined at the maximum rate of infiltration. So it is most often measured in the meters per day, but can also be measured in the other limit, so other unit of the distance over time at a necessary. The infiltration capacity decreases as the soil moisture content of the soil surface layers increase. So if the perspiration rate exceeds the and filtration rate. So runoff usually occur unless there is some physical value. Infiltrometers parameter and rainfall simulations are devices that can be used to measure infiltration rate. Infiltration is caused by multiple factors and including gravity, capacity, force absorption, and osmosis. Many soil characteristics can also play a role in determining and the rate at which infiltration occurs. So infiltration rate <coughs> may be defined at the meters per unit time of water. So entry into the soil regardless on the type of value of forces are gradients. The term hydraulic conductively, which have been defined at the meter per day of water, 
and shipping into the soil under the pull of gravity or under a unit hydraulic gradient should not be confused within the nutrition rate and filtration rate need not refer to saturated condition if to run drop of total drum to cubic meter so 0.000002 cubic meter fall per day on the square meter of the soil and observed into the soil the infiltration rate at 0.00 Double zero, double zero, zero two meter per day. Dear boy, water entry into soil is caused by the metric and gravitational force. So, therefore, this entry may occur. In the lateral and upward direction, as well as at the downward, one infiltration normally. So refer to the downward movement. The metric force usually predominates over the gravitational force during the early stage of water entry. and into soil so that observation made during the early stage of infiltration are bearing the considering the absence of gravity if water infiltration into a dry soil a different wetting front also called a wet front can be observed and this is a boundary between the wetted upper part of the soil and the dry lower part of the soil so if water is enter filtering into soil continuated in a clear plastic column one can observe the progress of the weight so front at the mark with front at the change with the time at present it is impossible to measure the metric potential exactly at the weight front because it progress to rapidly into the soil so however one can measure the amount of water infiltrated and the depth and the shape of the weight front and the come to important calculation about the entry of water into the soil and filtration is externally import because it determine not only the amount of water and that will be in the soil but also the interment of the passenger chemical nutrients and the will attempt to solve it the variability of the stream flow depend on the source of the supply and if the source of the stream flow is from surface runoff the stream will be characterized by short period of high flow and long period of low flow or no flow at all 
stream of this type are known <coughs> as a flux and if the basin is permeable there will be little surface runoff and ground water it will provide the stream with a high sustained uniform flow and these stream are known as the steady whether a stream is steady or flowsky depend on the infiltration or preparation of snow melt when it rain some of the water is intercepted by rain or building and some jet held in the low place on the ground so depression storage some flow over the ground to stream surface run off some is evaporated and some in filters of the water that in filters the part replenishes the soil moisture deficiency <clears throat> so if any while the remainder percolates deeper perhaps become the ground water and the depletion of the soil moisture begin immediately after a rain due to the evaporation and transpiration in infiltration capacity that is called f denote f is the maximum rate at which a soil and capable to absorbing water in water keeping condition so several factor control and filtration capacity and the strength when fall and soil moisture condition so soil moisture plus to fluctuate seasonal usually being high during winter and spring and low during in the summer and fall so if the soil is dry wetting the top of the well so create a strong capacity potential and just under the surface supplementary gravity and when wetted the clay performing the soil well this reduce the infiltration capacity shortly and after the rain star so compaction of the soil due to a rent of impact and was the material into soil opening which reduce infiltration capacity and teach it especially important if the soil is dry so compaction of the soil by animal road trail urban development etc certain micro structures in the soil will be promote infiltration such as a soil structure opening cause by growing animal and insect decaying rotless and other vegetative matter so frost having decision crack and other microscope so vegetative will cover which tend to increase the infiltration because it promote population of the browsing organism and retard surface runoff erosion and composition of the rain drop decreasing temperature 
which increasing water viscosity reading infiltration and intrude air into the unsaturated zone will tend to reduce infiltration surface gradient and filtration capacity is usually greater than or the start of the rain and that flow a dry period and that the decrease capacity after several hours is nearly constant because the soil become college by the practical and swelling clouds a sandy soil at the opposite to a clay and rich soil we maintain a high infiltration capacity of the considerable time so again we will discuss on the infiltration you have learned that here about the theme of infiltration now we will discuss infiltration in detail how infiltration has happened dear boy in this figure you are looking this is perspiration water is going on the ground less infiltration and non porous soil and the rock so it has stopped up to here and more infiltration which are going to under ground soil and the rock maybe it maintained on the water table and join the river maybe so the process of entering ran water to swell strata of the earth is called infiltration the infiltration water first meet the swell moisture deficiency if any excess water moves vertically down loop to the infiltration capacity of soil is defined at the maximum rate at which the it is capable of the absorbing water and demand by f this is the formula dry soil infiltration rate f is more moist soil infiltrated so f is less and maximum rate of water absorption by soil infiltration capacity so maximum capacity of water absorption by soil filled capacity the rate of which soil even absorb rainfall or irrigation <coughs> and it is measured in mm or in flotation is used for measurement of the infiltration and if i greater than f so runoff occurs and infiltration rate is connected to hydraulic conductivity hydraulic conductivity is availability of fluid to flow through a porous medium and it is determined by the size and the shape of the pore space in the medium viscosity of fluid or it is expressed as the volume of the fluid that will be moved into unit time under 
a unit hydraulic gradient and throw a unique area measured. So perpendicular to the duration direction of flow. Now, the slope of the land, the sleeper, the slope gradient less than the infiltration of the sea. Like this, this, and you can detail, you can this. Material are the less infiltration. Now we'll discuss on the porosity. Porosity is the percentage of open space, porous and crack in the earth surface. So this is the clay creek and this is the sponge. And the greater the porosity, the greater the amount of the infiltration. and packing of this is the swan. And surface cover of condition. So vegetation, grass, tree, and other plant type capture falling perspiration on the leaf and branches keeping, and that the water from the beginning absorb into earth and take more time to reach to the ground. So more the vegetation and sewer the infiltration. Land use, so road, parking, lots and building, some places that not longer permeable that infiltration is this. And now, fuel irrigation. This is showing the temperature of the viscosity, direct and infiltration assess. So, in trapped air, in the porous and in trapped air can greatly affect the hydronic condition or the near saturation. So quality of water, turbidity by colloidal water and freezing, freezing in the winter may raw lock porous and annual and seasonal change ascending to change in the land and use pattern so except or massive deforestation and agriculture measurement of infiltration so how you will measure the infiltration it is device you to measure the rate of water infiltration into soil. So type of infiltration in infiltrometer and uh, flooding type of infiltrometer and rainfall simulators and single ring and double ring. The consist of metal cylinder of diameter 25 centimeter to 30 centimeter and length of the 50 centimeter and 60 centimeter with both end open the length of cylinder is equal to 2x diameter. I take the drive it into a level ground and such about 10 centimeter of the cylinder it's 
above a ground and water is poured into the top part to a depth of the 5 cm and pointer is set inside the ring of the indicative the water level to the mentioned the single ring involved driving ring into the swab and supplying water in the ring either the consistent or falling head condition so consent head refer to the condition where the amount of water in the ring is always held consist means the rate of water supply corresponds to the interfiltration capacity so falling head refer to condition where water is supplied in the ring and the water allowed to the t drop with the time and the operator record how much water goes into the swell for given time period this is the diagram for showing the character the major drawback the single ring and filtrometer of tube and infiltrometer is that the infiltrated water and the percolates literally in the bottom of tube so thus the tube is not truly representing and the through which infiltration taking place This is the, this is the most commonly used flooding type and and flow meter. So it consists of two concrete ring driving into the soil unformally without distributing the soil to the least to the depth of 15 centimeter, and the diameter of ring may vary between 25 centimeter to 60 centimeter and inner ring the travel into the ground and second bigger ring a ground that is the help control the flow of the water through the first ring what are the supply either with the consist of the filling need and condition and the separator is called we much water infiltrate from the inner ring and into the soil over a given time period this is the first ring and second ring and this is the test This is the measurement of infiltration. In this small plot of the land, two meter into four meter size is provided with the scale of nodules on the longer side, with arrangement to collect the major. the surface then of reed and the especially design nodule produce rain drop falling from the height of 2 meter and the capable of the producing various intensive of the rainfall experiment are conducting under controlled condition with the various combination of the in initiated and the duration and the surface run of rate or volume are measured in the each case so using the water budget equation and filtration rate and its variation with time and estimate
P is equal to participation, R is equal to surface runoff, and G is equal to ground water. So flow is equal to F evaporation and T is equal to transpiration and change in storage. So plot of land, two meter by four meter. So the spatially designed model produced a raindrop falling from height of two meter. So under controlled condition, various combination of the inter initiates the duration and the surface turn of rate with the volume are measured in each case. So P R G E T is equal to delta S. The inflation rate at the velocity or speed at the which water enters into the soil and it is usually measured by the depth mm of the water layer that can be enter of the soil in one hour or rate at which water enter the soil at the surface. So it is denoted by the F under the T. So depth of water in 40 during given time and period it is the denoted by F T. Infer infiltration capacity rate curve. Obtained from the infiltration meter is essential observed to be to be decline curve maximum to minimum. Some mathematical experiment to describe the shape of curve given by various investigations are Horton equation, Phillips equation. Coscoto equation and Holotens equation, where F1 is called infiltration capacity and Fc is equal to minimum infiltration capacity and T is equal to time since in the start of the rainfall and K is the constant depending upon soil type and vegetable cover. Phillips equation. Here a minimum inflotation capacity S is equal to initial inflotation capacity. So cost the co of equation F is equal to A into T power M, such as Holtens equation F is equal to A F H power P plus F E. So here is above method A and N are constant and depend on soil moisture and vegetable over. Now for consistency, the hydrological calculation, a constant value of the infiltration rate for the entire storm during is adopted and the average infiltration rate called infiltration index. The two commonly used infiltration index are the following. That is the mu is equal to index W minus and F. There are externally used for the analysis of major flood when the soil is wet and the infiltration rate becomes constant. Now index for the catchment during a storm should depend on the soil type, vegetation cover, initial moisture and condition. So application 
estimation of the flood magnetic due to optical storm for the soil condition of india this is the showing equation the vegetation has subsequently evaporated as surface flow and steam flow and evaporation for a given storm the interaction loss is estimated as so this is the all formula now runoff and computation here by runoff after infiltration remaining precipitation of the surface is called runoff after infiltration remaining precipitation of the surface is called runoff so draining of the participation a catchment area through surface channel and component of the runoff so it crowding to source from which the flow is diverted the total runoff consist of the surface runoff so sub surface runoff for the principal purpose of analysis of total runoff so direct runoff based flow this is the direct runoff sub surface surface runoff so surface then of the water flow that occurs when the soil is inverted to the full capacity and access water from the rain so melt water or other resources flow over the land and it is combined over land flow and channel perspiration so sub surface runoff the lecture movement of the water occurring to the soil and above the water having it is also known as water inflow so inflow of the portion of the stream of flow contributed by the inflated water to move latently and the sub surface unit in the region of the channel so over land and flow when the excess participation process over the land surface to reach a smaller stream channel for the practical purpose of the analysis of the total runoff direct runoff and base flow so direct runoff which is the composed of contribution from surface runoff and quick interflow in hydrograph analysis refer only a direct runoff and base flow so base flow which is the composed of the contribution from delayed interflow and groundwater runoff now runoff area and runoff volume from the area mainly influenced of the following two factors climatic factor and uh, physiographic factor so climatic factor associate with the characteristic which include the type of participation 
rainfall intensity and rainfall duration. Physiographic factor include both water set and channel characteristic such as size of water set and uh, orientation water set, land use, soil type and type of drainage work and slope of catchment. The type of participation, state participation at the liquid rainfall and solid health at the suggestion of fog. So rainfall intensity, thus the high intensity of the rainfall in higher runoff where it, uh, I is greater than F. And quick runoff, so I is less than F. Low runoff. So duration of the rainfall directly related to volume of the run for uh, runoff or basic infiltration rate of soil decrease with the duration of rainfall. Now climatic factor. So direction of prevailing wind is the direction of prevailing wind is the same drainage system and its result peak flow a storm removing or the direction a storm hope produce the higher peak is a plotter and the by the opposite direction so antecedent moisture or moisture. Magnitude of runoff will depend upon the initial moisture present in the soil at the time of rainfall. And it is a rain occur after the long by the spill and then in infiltration rate is more. Hence, the contribute less runoff. And orientation of the study of water set. So it has complex effect and it control the time of overland flow and time of concentration of rainfall, that is the stop watershed result at a greater runoff due to the greater runoff velocity. And orientation of the watershed, so this affect its evaporation and transpiration loss for the area. The north or south orientation also affect the time of melting of the collected soil. So land use, more vegetation, less runoff, less vegetation, more runoff. The size of water set. If a large water set take longer time of drainage and the runoff Outlet, then a smaller water set and soil type. The infiltration rate vary with the type of soil. And so runoff is a great affected by soil type. An open textured soil or porous soil like sand have high infiltration rate and hence less than the drained soil and obviously the compacted soil and may have high rate of the runoff is less infiltration rate.
the type of drainage network so more tributaries are and stream called less overland so how and surface run off concentrate resulting in high peak quality and shape of the catchment so in located catchment are in subject to high run off peak and the numericals indicate like form factor circulatory ratio compensatory coefficient will express shape of the catchment continuously so basic in dependability in and the initial basin discharge basin in so ail means of the produce or gain getting any product from the natural resources is called yielding and basin in means quantity of water available from the uh, a stream as a given point over a specified during of time and time duration of yield would be would be month longer and this is the formula of this so you have read detail infiltration and runoff and uh, on this topic i want to ask you some uh, mcq support question number 1 a multi purpose reservoir is uh, the one which so what is the correct answer in force all four uh, answer is looking on your screen one answer is correct so which is the correct correct answer is b yes planned and constructed to serve various purpose and uh, next a rain gauge should possibly be fixed so which are correct answer correct answer is c in an open space and uh, A repelling grion is aligned. So, which is correct answer? Yes, correct. Pointing of the stream. This is the correct answer. A. Now, a hydroelectric scheme operating under the head of a meter run and be classified as. yes it is correct uh, the answer is a high head scheme and correct answer is c next question is a hydrograph the graphical presentation of so correct answer is a rainfall intensity and time and next question a land is known as a water logged so which are correct answer yes correct answer c capillary image reach to be root zone of plant and uh, next question A seventy percent index of wetness means 
Tell me first. Correct answer B, rain deficiency at 30%. And a deep well. So this is the four answer about the deep well. It's written in your screen, which is correct. Correct is B, has more discharge than a silo well. Now a current meter is huge, we measure. So which are correct answer? Correct answer is my dear boy, the velocity of flow of water. And now, Last question, a divide wall is provided, where provided? This four situation are written in your answer, which are correct. Yes, correct answer is A at the right angle of the axis of V. This is the uh, references where we have taken from the net and this is the references also. And uh, thank you very much for taking interest in my class. You are welcome tomorrow in my next class.